back to the channel, everyone. As you can see, I got a guest along with me, good buddy Jeremiah. We are uh, currently headed north. It is still turkey season here in Wisconsin, so we're gonna keep grinding and keep hunting as much as we can. He's got a spot in mind. We're gonna hit that in the morning. We're camping out tonight in my truck. We got about an hour drive, and uh, hopefully everything goes well. Get up there just before dark, maybe get a bird located, and then in the morning we are gonna hunt. And I got about five, six hours tomorrow morning that I can hunt until I gotta get back home. But we're gonna give it a go. Camp out in the truck tonight and uh, bring you guys along. So stay tuned, and hopefully we can uh, hopefully we can kill a bird. Just got up here. Bugs are absolutely insane once again. We're gonna shoot a call, see if we can get a bird located for the morning, and we're gonna go from there. It's like Godzilla. Godzilla freaking mosquitoes. Them things are huge. <laughs> They're everywhere. Oh my gosh, look at these mosquitoes. Seriously, they're absolutely terrible. Yep, good thing I bought a bug zapper for in here. stopped at. We got a bird. It's fired up. He's hot. We're gonna go in here and if we kill him tonight that'd be absolutely insane. Otherwise we know we got something to work with in the morning. I'm not wearing any camo. We have no time. We gotta get in here because they're gonna be going to roost. So I think he's already over there. He's on that ridge. right there. Yeah, dude, he's right there. Jeremiah, Jeremiah, he's in the road. There he goes, right up the hill. You see him? This ain't good. What? What are we gonna do about the food situation with all these bugs? Man, I think we're just gonna eat snacks. There's so many bugs, which we got most of them out of here, but we got a good idea for the morning, good plan. Got him roosted, he's about 200 yards in the woods right here. Dude, you got so many bugs between you and I right now. <laughs> we're gonna put that new uh, new bug zapper to the test tonight, but we're gonna- We're gonna have to do something here. There's bugs in here all night. I ain't sleeping on the head <laughs> like a nail. But we're gonna drive in the woods here and uh, figure out the situation we got going. We got a bird roosted. Is that two? Two roosted, so. Yeah. Drive back in here and figure out what we're gonna do. Bugs are absolutely gnarly. Oh, guys, we we're gonna make food tonight. I have everything all situated, set up. We're gonna do some turkey tacos. 
and if you guys can even see them right now, we are not doing that. It's late. We just pulled in. I mean, look at these bugs. Oh my gosh. That bug zapper better work. I'm gonna put it in the truck tonight. We're just gonna grab something quick out of the back. I think I maybe have a can of chili or something, maybe heat it up. And we're just gonna go off of that tonight, eat some snacks, but these bugs, the mosquitoes, it's all marshy around here. And they're absolutely insane. So we're just gonna set the truck up quick, find something to snack on or eat, hop in the truck and just kick back and watch a movie. Turn the bug zapper on and hope it does wonders. Better than those are not sleeping. I'm not sleeping. <laughs> this is gonna be me all night. Eat some plain cans of chili and some peanuts. <laughs> <laughs> Eating a can of chili, two guys in the truck. Not a good idea. Everything all situated and set up. As you guys can see, we got bugs in here like no other. I hope to God this bug zapper works good. Otherwise, we are screwed. So many bugs. Insanity. Oh my goodness. Freaking bugs, man. It's about that time of year, turkey season, they come out in full force. I'm trying to smoke a cigar, to keep them away. Somebody recently left a comment on the channel, told me I should buy one of these so I got a little Ozark trail little bug zapper here with a lantern built in it's all rechargeable we're gonna set this up in there quick and we're gonna sit out here without the lights on it's not terrible but in here the bugs are hot and heavy I'm gonna hang this right from my bracket here I hope it's charged oh look at that we're gonna hang it in here and hopefully it takes care of some of these bugs because they are so bad <laughs> Let that let, oh my gosh, dude, there's so many in here. So many. Please work. Please work. It's gonna suck if this does not work. Go to work. Go to work, little buddy. Got a lot of them to kill. Alright, guys. We're sad to make food out here really quick tonight. Bugs are dying down i think it's because the colder temps cooler temps and then the, the winds picked up just a little bit we have more bugs in the truck than we do outside but attach this quick i'm just gonna warm us up a couple cans of chili we are gonna call that good we're gonna call that good for the night just some quick chili Good looking chili. Hmm? Some good looking chili. I think it's been froze in a time or two. <laughs> Thought I'd back out. Staying mobile during turkey season and doing it on a budget. Got some cheap uh, Hormel chili. That's uh, a lot easier to work with there. We're just camping on here with the turkeys tonight, folks. Got one roosted probably. Say 150 200 yards from us right now. Mm -hmm. We got a game plan for the morning. Hopefully, that pans out. We're just gonna make some quick, quick din din. Hop in the truck, pick out a movie, and go to sleep. And hopefully, kill some turkeys in the morning. I should say at least eight turkey. We're not eating at least 150 mosquitoes per bite. We're not doing that right. <laughs> She's getting a little bit more pliable here. She's warming up. I chase the turkey. I'm gonna poop my pants. Should have got those plates out of there. Oh well. Just dump right back in the can and eat it out of there. Might as well. This whole meal alone is probably about three dollars. Yeah, four that. bucks, maybe. Oh yeah, she's looking good. Jeremiah's been mixing the pot here for a little bit, getting her all nice and toasty. Pretty good at stirring the pot.
Oh. Mm hmm. Well, uh, there we go. Sit out here and eat this quick. It's hot. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. It's good though. Good enough. Quick fix. After not eating hardly anything this afternoon. I'm just trying not to eat any mosquitoes. We bought some chips and stuff at the gas station, so we'll just have that for a snack, some peanuts or whatever, and pick out a movie, and then we're just going to be going to bed. we got to wake up early, so. There we are. Quick, good, and easy meal. Time to hop in the truck. Well, the old bug zapper, I think, killed about a solid three. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, dude. We're going to have to, like, roll the window down and blast the AC or something for a minute. All righty, guys. Just turned the truck off. Jeremiah and I have been swatting bugs out of here. We turned the AC on. Um, we got a lot of them out. I think I'm just going to turn this bug zapper on just for a little bit. Oh, yeah, you can still hear them. There's probably about 10 in here compared to 300 there was. But, anyways... We got the tablet on. We're gonna kick back, watch the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Now that we, majority of these bugs, we shoot them out. But either way, there's still mosquitoes in here. Hopefully, the bug zapper will finish them off. And uh, yeah, we're gonna watch this. Oh, and the boonies watching Texas Chainsaw Massacre, and then uh, get some shut eye, and we're gonna be up bright and early. So I probably won't see you guys anymore tonight. I think we're just gonna watch this and head to bed. So I'll see you guys bright and early, and. Hopefully we have some uh, good luck in the morning and we can put a bird on the ground. Good night, y'all. Success! On the pocket of the cell signal over yonder. So apparently the bus took a wrong turn like 20 miles back. Good morning, everybody. It's just after four. It's early. It's early and it's go time. So we're going to get out. Get everything on, get dressed in a camo, and try to make a play on this bird this morning. So, hopefully, everything goes well and we can get them on the ground. So, see you guys shortly. Oh, yeah. Oh.
You get them? You do? Hell yeah, dude. <laughs> <laughs> this freaking gun hit him so hard, dude. He didn't even flop. <laughs> That's how she's done. That's what I'm talking about. Doesn't get much quicker than that. Perfect setup. I wish I could have been up there, but I just didn't want to get picked off having them come up there. Yeah. I honestly didn't even know he could see that bird and he just shot. It scared me to death, but we got one down. Try to get another one. Not a bad bird. Heck yeah, dude. <laughs> nice shooting, Tex. <laughs> Hell yeah, that was quick. Now I get to go try to kill one of them. Five, seven, eight, something splitters, yeah? Yeah, I was looking at that. Not bad. Nice beard, really pretty fan. Heck yeah, try to kill another one. Another one, we got a couple more of them. That's how the plan comes together right there. Got him, dude. Came in quiet, dude. My ears rang so bad. I had to wait, dude. I had no shot. There was a tree right there. I told you I thought I heard a gobble. As soon as he cleared that gap, my dad's gonna be stoked about that. We freaking did her. Freaking did her, boy. Two for two. Is it before six o'clock? It's right after. Hell yeah, dude. Dude, that's crazy though that we saw him. We never would even known. I'm glad you saw him there. Yeah. He, I was, that's why I kept peeking over and then I stopped looking over there and I was looking over here and then if I would have had the gun right there, it would have been game over. Tell you what, boy, the old antler, lucky charm. Little guy. <laughs> little guy. I thought he had a bigger beard. Just a little guy. Still a Tom. I don't know, he probably doesn't have shit for spurs. Oh, not too bad. That's a really little bird, though. 15 pounds, maybe? Here we are again. The old lucky turkey carrier. Toted many birds out of the woods. Could be lame. Smells like victory. Hard to beat that, dude. 
beautiful morning, two birds down in what, hour and a half, not even? Not even, barely an hour. Little guy, that doesn't weigh much at all, but he's got decent spurs. And about a nine and a half, 10 inch beard, just a pencil. We're gonna get this guy out of here and go chase some more. back to the truck. I've been playing cat and mouse with the bird over here this morning. We're gonna go chase him now. He's still gobbling, but here we go. Number two. That's pretty neat. Right out here on the property we're hunting. Got an old abandoned bus. Critters have been in here. Sleeping night in there, huh? Oh my goodness, that's disgusting. It's all poop. Some sort of critter pooping in the in the sink in there. The whole thing, the whole sink's full of poop. That's what you call a fabulous morning. Right on the old bus. Beautiful birds. Smokes. Oh. Don't see that every day while turkey hunting. It's pretty awesome. Alrighty, guys. I'm back home now. Uh, we had quite an eventful day, to say the least. We uh, killed two this morning, ended up driving around this afternoon, couldn't find much for birds, ended up striking one up on public, went after them, and uh, I ended up killing two more. Here they are, there's mine, you got Jeremiah's, these Jake's, these are really good sized Jake's actually. It's bigger than my bird this morning when it comes to body. Great big brushy beard. Not a bad beard on that one either for a Jake, but a lot of good eating meat right there. I'm tagged out now, and now I gotta wait till six season, try killing a couple more. That's what I like to do during turkey season. If I can, I will just sleep in my truck, try to locate the bird the night before, stay in there real close to him, and then get in there, slip in there real early and play the game. And this morning, it couldn't have worked any better. It was a lot of fun. It's a good, cheap, easy way to do it. Just camp out in the vehicle, and we made cheap food. We had cans of chili last night, and yeah staying mobile and it's cheap and it's effective so overall had a great time thanks to jeremiah for uh taking me up to his spot and we will catch you guys real soon on another adventure i love y'all take care and i'll see you soon